that start. Okay, good. Yes, sir. Oh, we are now. Okay, good. I guess if you watch it now, you can see where it's depositing it. Yeah, it is depositing. It's taking it from over here, really. Mm -hmm. And it's depositing it at that point bar. So it is really creating a point bar, it really is. Even though we're not adding anything to it. It is. So it's, it's taking it from up here. It's kind of making the jump too to the other side. I, is there some like different? Oh, you want? Uh, yeah, we have to leave it now. If we need to. I grabbed one of those out earlier. I'm going to take the measurements. That's one thing we should do though. We should make sure that the upper layer is pretty much clean and stuff. This kind of stuff is good. It'd be like a big tree. Yeah. Something like that. But you are getting some some uh, fucking behavior though. I mean, it is. It's amazing to watch sand, it's moving right. What's that? It's amazing to watch sand, it's moving right through there. Yeah. And there's a lot of erosion on that. It'd be interesting to see if you could cut down probably several tons of millimeters on there. Yeah. It's still screwing everything else. Yeah, you got some good. You can see in here, maybe. You got one, two, three, almost four. You got four. Let's see, that was the wrong spot. I think it's that one down there. <laughs> that point part down there is the wrong spot. So that should be where it's going to be. Oh, there's a tree. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's, that's great. It's going quite well. Look at it. Can, bad, I kind of wish we had another one, like. Uh, already for us, I did four, right? Yeah. Like, the only thing is, is like we only start capturing it here, so we miss out on that one. I'll look at that later. That is very nice though. It's working really well. So, so but our slope is screwed up. So, <laughs> well now it now it's kind of well no it's still up well it, it is actually it's trying to establish a slope right because it's cutting way down down there. Yeah. And it's not cutting a lot down here, so it's actually trying to establish a slope. So it'd be interesting to see what it's establishing actually, what over time, what, what kind of slope it's establishing. That's the other thing you can plot over time is your profile, right? You can show that. In fact, it might be an interesting experiment anyway to have it start out of post, because then you can see how your slope is actually going to develop itself over time, and see what the stable slope is for this. But it's, so you got one, two, three, almost starting to be four right there. Yeah. Good. Yeah. So you can get a pretty good wavelength. So, uh, so I would. So the, the normal sort of um, lore is that the, the wavelength of the, the meanders is supposed to be five channel widths. So like this width should be about one, two, three, four, five. Which actually, all right. That's kind of what it roughly ends up usually. Okay. So this this wavelength from here to here is supposed to be about five channel wavelengths. For John and Wicks, that's my channels. Cool. Uh, I think it's working quite well. Alright, okay, well, now for the other half hour of the uh, forward part. Yeah. Now, the really tough part we're going to be using data, though, you know? Yeah. This is, this is one. Wait, this is one. Okay. So, what we do is we open up basically a blank one. Blank one here. Alright, now this blank one. And just rename it. Um, we file rename it the time that it actually is. You say that as you know. Almost that. Yeah, it'd be nice if it was an automated way to do it or something, but it's not that easier. You start there, you can start there. I was just going to start down here. Yeah. No. So I'm sorry to take it. Yeah, it'd be nice if there was like a, uh, you know, a track or something. Or just, yeah, just something like that would give you, like, there has to be. Isn't there something like, kind of like if you take like the sense of like, you know, like a profile, like how they do seismic profiles, like this, 
said we would want it to do just a surface profile, basically. If you had just something you could, it's like, if you just had a whole bunch of these laid across at once, that would be. Yeah, I'm sure. I mean, I'll think about that in terms of the way I could design it. Because, yeah, it would be really cool if you could have a way to sort of. Because then all you'd have to do is just it. read it. But, I mean, that's down the line. It's like one of those like, site, what do they call it? Distance readers, like, like hunters use, you know? But you need it, like, as part of a camera attack, yeah. right? Same. Oh, so do it all at the same time. Yeah, it's a really neat to 